In today's video, we'll show you how to use Google Earth Studio to create smart zoom transition effects. If you want to know how to do that, please keep watching the video. Google Earth Studio is a new feature launched by Google. It allows us to create some cool effects very easily. Enter Google Earth Studio in Google Browser. Go to the official homepage. Click on the Try Earth Studio. If you use it for the first time, a request form will pop up. Fill out information and click Submit. Now wait for a short time. Google will inform you by email after a successful registration. Then go back to main screen again. Click on Try Earth Studio and you will enter the official interface. Here, Google provides several templates to choose from. And we are going to choose point to point and click start. This will bring you to the map interface. Here, enter the first address you want to create. For example, here I want to start with Golden Gate Bridge. Then the map will automatically find a location. On the map, you can see a highlighted area in the middle. This is the camera. You can use the pen, orbit, and the zoom controls to fine tune your camera position. Adjust the camera so that the image in the camera match your frame in your own video. Click on this green button. Then go ahead and enter the next location in the area. For example, here I type in Times Square. Same as before, adjust the position of the camera. Then click on this green button. The Earth Studio will generate a preview animation. The numbers indicate the duration of each shot, followed by geographical location. Click the green button again after you confirm. And you will be brought to the editing page but ignore them here for now. We'll explain in details in the next video. We we'll just click on Render here. Then, you can change your project lamp here. At the bottom, you can choose the export format. Here, we choose MP4. And leave the other parameters unchanged. Click Submit. The system will start to generate the video. After a while, you will be able to see it in the cloud windows. Click this button to download the video. Next, let's open VidiPop Logger. Import a footage you shot and a footage generated by the Google Earth Studio. Put three videos following the order of Location 1 video, Google Earth Studio video, Location 2 video in the video track. Then use Ripple Edit to crop the footage to the right length. Then click on Transition. Find a zoom blur. Drag and drop it to the transition point in the video. For bad effect, you can also add some wood sound effect during the transition. And there you have it, a simple Google Earth Studio Map zoom transition video. Well, this is all for today's video. In the next video, we'll continue to show you how to use Google Earth Studio to create a city walkthrough effect. And if you want to learn more about other and tricks or what has been going on with Video Pop Logger, be sure to click that subscribe button to your subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in the next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.